guys, welcome to Grayson's two year update! Woohoo! Grayson, how old are you? How old are you? See, I'm two! Two! two. Woohoo! Yeah, so today is a couple days after his second birthday, but yes, he is now two years old now. I don't know how long, how much he'll be in this video just because he does like to move a lot, but I thought I would include him at least in the very beginning. Yeah, so Grayson is two, so I thought I would just kind of talk a little bit about what his life is like as a two-year-old and his accomplishments and things like that. So, Grayson now weighs 28 pounds. I was able to weigh him on our scale at home. Unfortunately, his two-year-old doctor's appointment has been pushed back. Um, until further notice. Sorry, there's gonna be music in the background because he's playing with his toys, but yeah, we were supposed to go to his two-year-old doctor's appointment, but that has gotten rescheduled due to the coronavirus, and so I don't know how tall he is or what percentile his weight and height or even head measurement is, but I will have that hopefully soon, depending on how long this virus lasts, I guess. But yes, he is 28 pounds. I don't know if that's a lot or not. Everyone thinks that he looks really tall for his age, so it'll be interesting to see what his um, height is. Grayson loves reading. He loves reading books, and he's always loved reading books. He has several of his books memorized. He loves Little Blue Truck. Brown Bear, Brown Bear, the Going to Bed book. Um, recently for his two-year-old birthday, we got him a book, and it's an A to Z book, and he has the whole book memorized. He loves it. He loves pop-up books where you open it and then like something pops up. He loves those kind of books. He loves books where they have flaps on them. He loves books about animals. Grayson loves sequences, and... It's so funny because he loves routines, and I think a lot of kids like that. So, like, for bedtime, when I put him in his crib, we have a whole um, dialogue that we go through every night. I put him in, and I say, okay, and I love you, and he says, I'll see you when I wake up, and I'll say, yep, I'll see you when you wake up, and he'll say, I love you, I'll say, I love you, I'll say, night. I'll say, night. and it just keeps going on and on. And, and, like the other day I told him like happy birthday because it was his birthday and now every time he's included happy birthday to it. So it's really funny. But yes, he loves sequences, which is really funny. Grayson loves music. He has several nursery rhymes memorized. He knows Itsy Bitsy Spider, Twinkle Twinkle Little Star, um, Humpty Dumpty is his favorite right now. We sing that probably a million times a day, it feels like. Um, so he loves all those songs. Grayson loves listening to super simple songs on YouTube. He also likes Coco Melon on YouTube. Um, he still loves Baby Bum on Netflix. Um, and I think that show has taught him a lot of, he knows all of his shapes, um, circle, triangle, uh, square, all those, you know, within reason. Obviously he doesn't know like Pentagon, but he knows a lot of the shapes. He can count from 1 to 20, um, and he does that really well. He knows his ABCs, he knows the song, and then we also have a lot of different like ABC toys, and he knows, like if I say like, where is the S, or where is the G, or where is the M, like he will find it and show me. He is so smart, like I feel like good as a parent, like he knows a lot of his stuff already. Um, you know, they say walk by one, talk by two. Grayson was not walking by his first birthday, but he is definitely talking by his second birthday. He says a lot. Um, I think I see, I'll see you when I wake up. I think that's the longest sentence that he knows. Um, but he will, he'll say, you know, his favorite words right now are Alexa, because we have one of those that he knows music comes from. He loves saying no. He says it a lot, <laughs> even when he doesn't mean it. He also loves saying milk. He is still obsessed with milk. He drinks it all the time. Crazy mouths. I still have him on full milk right now. I'm waiting until the doctor appointment to find out if I need to switch him or keep him on that. Grayson has all of his aunts and uncles' names memorized, which is pretty awesome because he has six aunts and uncles. 
Um, he's got all their pets' names memorized. Yeah, he knows wheels on the bus. He just does a lot. He's a talking machine. And he's always talking to himself. He's always singing to himself. So it's really fun just to listen to him. You can hear him in the background. He's talking to himself or singing, I don't know. We're working on independent play for Grayson. He will do it at some times. Other times he likes me around. He's definitely attached to me. He's currently climbing over the couch. Here it is. Um, he is a crazy climber. He climbs on everything. He's a daredevil. He's got bruises all down his legs because he does crazy flips off the couch and he climbs whatever he can and gets stuck in a million different places. So I always have to keep my eye on him. He finally, maybe about a couple weeks ago, finally figured out how to go down the stairs by himself. Before then, if he were to go down, he would just tumble. So finally, he has figured that out. We have not gone into potty training yet. Uh, we have a potty out. He knows the sequence. Uh, if you go poop, where do you go poop? On the potty, not in your diaper. So he knows the sequence. He tells it to me, but I don't think he understands what that means um, because he doesn't mind sitting in a poopy diaper. You can see him behind me. <laughs> He's just climbing all over the couch. He loves going outside. He loves his swing. He's got a slide that he loves as well. We go for walks. He loves going on walks in the stroller. Grayson hates getting dressed. He hates getting his diaper changed. Anything where he has to be still, he hates. Um, I've had been having a, a hard time feeding him lately. He just doesn't want to sit and eat. He just wants to be on the go. He is definitely not a chill baby. He moves, he is constantly on the move, constantly doing something, does not sit still. Grayson is going to become a big brother um, in about five months, and so we're very excited for that. Um, it'll be interesting to see how his big brother role plays out, so check back at, I'll probably do another two, um, update on him at like two and a half months if I remember. So check back in uh, six months to see how that's going. Grayson loves jumping in puddles. I mean, he's just like any kid. He just loves um, things like that. He loves pointing out numbers everywhere. If we're at the grocery store, he will point out what number aisle we're in. He finds letters everywhere and points them out to me. Um, it'll be really exciting when he goes to school next year and, um, and we'll, when he's three, he'll go to three-year-old preschool and we'll see, you know, him just blossoming, you know, learn so many new things. It's going to be so fun. Grayson still loves animals. He loves Felix, but he's still pretty rough with him for working on it. He loves dogs. We have lots of dogs. Well, a lot of my siblings have dogs. My my parents have a dog, Anthony's parents have a dog, and so he's always around dogs. He loves animals. Um, Grayson knows a lot of animals. He knows all the animal noises, all the common ones anyway. Um, if you ask him, he will tell you what they say, which is really cute. He loves Paw Patrol. He loves Blue's Clues. Um, and he also watches Sesame Street because he loves Elmo. His favorite toys right now, I mean, he loves his books. He just got a bunch of puzzles for his birthday and he loves um, doing puzzles. He has this Wheels on the Bus board game toy, but it just sings Wheel on the Bus, which you can hear in the background. He's obsessed with that right now. Um, he's not too into stuffed animals. We do have a couple things where like you have to imaginary play with them. We have like a little um, little tykes um, uh, farm where there's a bunch of animals and you can play with them. And then we also have like a pirate ship where you can pretend you're a pirate and do things. But he doesn't really seem to understand like pretend play or things like that. So we're working on that. Grayson loves me. He loves his daddy. He started to say daddy more often than dada, which is super fun to hear. I think it's so cute. He loves Anthony. He, um, especially Anthony's been working from home a lot lately because of the coronavirus and so he loves seeing his daddy all the time. He definitely has a preference for me. However, I am a stay-at-home mom. I, I'm with him all the time, so that would make sense. Grayson loves bath time. Um, he loves getting in the bath. He'll take like hour baths. He loves it. I have to make sure the water is like warm enough so that it stays warm the whole time he's in it. Grayson loves story time. We have a, I think he likes the sequence of story time because a lot of the story times they do the same things in, in like in sequence and a routine. And so he really enjoys that. 
we've learned a lot of different like songs and nursery rhymes from that. Grayson loves helping me clean. He's obsessed with the vacuum. He loves vacuums. Anytime we go anywhere and he finds a vacuum, he gets very excited about it. He likes to help me vacuum, although help. <laughs> he loves sweeping with the broom. We have to take turns. I'll sweep a little bit and then he will sweep a little bit. So he loves doing that. He has his own toys. They're like behind me back there, but he doesn't seem to care for them. He wants the real things. <laughs> I've been noticing more freckles on Grayson as he gets bigger. He's got one like on, like by his thumb on his hand. He's also got like one on his inner thigh. So I've been seeing those. Um, appear more. He still has the blonde hair, the blue eyes. His hair gets darker when it gets longer, um, but for now it's staying pretty blonde. Grayson is terrified of this uh, Humpty Dumpty video on Super Simple Songs. I wouldn't put it here for you, but that's copyright, so you'll just have to go look it up if you're curious. It's Super Simple Songs Humpty Dumpty. He is terrified of it. They have an egg and the egg falls and it has cracks all over his face and he is terrified of it. Um, he'll watch other versions of Humpty Dumpty on other YouTube channels, but he will not watch the one on Super Simple Songs, which is really funny. Also, he got a LeapFrog laptop for his birthday, and if you push, like, the letters on the laptop, it'll say, like, A is for Apple, and then it'll, like, show, like, ah, uh, ah, uh, and then it'll show, like, an apple. Well, if you push the V, it says V is for Vulture, and then it has, like, this weird noise along with it, and you see a vulture. He's terrified of it. He, for a day, he wouldn't even go into the living room because he knew the laptop was in there. Hi! <laughs> so anyway, yeah, I'm, tr I'm slowly trying to get him to get used to the laptop again, but every time I bring it up, he says, it's scary. <laughs> right? Is the laptop scary? Yeah, it's scary, he says. It's not scary. Um, but yeah, he thinks it is. Grayson's one dance move that he has right now is he just spins around in circles. He's obsessed with Baby Shark. He loves Baby Shark. Grayson's favorite food, he loves bananas. He eats bananas every day. He also loves apples. He loves um, Teddy Graham crackers. He loves ice cream. I mean, who doesn't? Come on. <laughs> um, he likes spaghetti. He'll eat that. Not crazy about mac and cheese. I'm trying to get him into it, but he just does not seem to care for it. He loves basically any fruit, but when it comes to vegetables, it's a struggle. So we're working on vegetables. He loves cookies, you know, candy, anything like that. We don't give it to him very often, but you know, he's a kid. He likes any kind of sugar, sugary things. I plan on getting um, his two-year-old pictures done with a professional photographer. I'm just waiting on this. We have a stay-at-home order right now with this whole coronavirus thing going on, so I'm waiting on the stay-at-home order to be lifted for us to have those pictures done. Um, but as soon as they are, I'm sure I'll put them in a vlog somewhere. Grayson has become a lot more cuddly lately, and it's really sweet. Whenever he first wakes up, he just wants to like snuggle with me, which that's been new because usually he's just on the go like crazy, and so he's been slowing down a little bit and cuddling a little bit more, which is really fun. Grayson has his own language, as I'm sure every kid does, and he constantly tries to tell me what he wants, but you know, there are some times where I just can't understand, and when I try to guess it and I'm wrong, he gets very angry with me. He's stubborn, and he gets frustrated very easily, um, but back to the stubbornness, um, we've been trying to get him to say please a lot more when we're when he's asking for something We'll say say please and he does not want to say please so we have been struggling a little bit on that um, We've been implementing timeout a little bit more not too much But timeout has been a struggle because every time I put him in timeout. He just laughs and thinks it's a game He has been getting a lot more whiny lately um, lately, I, you know, he whines about a lot, which I get it, it's a kid thing, um, but we're trying to not whine. I'm trying to get him, if he's frustrated or he needs help, he needs to say, I need help, or help mama, you know, try to reach out for help instead of just being frustrated and crying. Um, I will tell him, like, no whining, and he'll say back to me, no whining. <laughs> so I don't know if he really gets it, but we're working on it. I recently got Grayson a baby doll. He 
he's playing with it right now because I want him to practice becoming a big brother. But he just kind of like chucks the baby doll everywhere. So um, yeah, it hasn't been going too well, but we, ha we still have some time. We have like five months before this baby comes. So yeah, he just threw it. I don't know if you could see that, but he just threw it. Uh, we're working on it. Grayson does not have a lot of a long attention span like most kids, and he's just so go go go. He does not watch movies, um, TV shows are hit and miss. Um, he just has a very short attention span. Grayson is in uh, two T clothes, some twenty four month clothes, but mostly two T uh, jammies. He's been in two T for a while, so I'd say since about eighteen months. And he's honestly starting to grow out of the 2T. Um, there are a lot of them are like cotton jammies. So we're gonna have to move up to 3T jammies. So that's gonna be an adventure. I think that's all for this video. So I got Grayson to come say bye bye. Can you say bye bye? Can you wave? Say I love you. Can you blow kisses? Ma. Yeah. <laughs> Ma, good! Yeah, so thank you for watching this video. Um, leave any comments down below if you have any questions about Grayson. Um, <laughs> he's just crazy, but he makes life so fun and so busy. So, uh, thanks for watching this video. Subscribe to my channel. Give this video a thumbs up, and we will see you guys next time. Bye!